Today on Real Life, how young Canadians are helping to improve the environment at Eco Action Kids National Awards Celebration in Toronto. Tips on exercising your abs effectively with real life fitness expert Andy Dumas and no bake treats that take minutes to make. All that and more coming up next on Real Life. Hi and welcome to Real Life. It's Wednesday, a beautiful day, and we're here at the Brickworks just along the Don Valley for a very special event, which we'll get to in just a moment. Great stuff coming up on today's show. We'll tell you what's happening here in our special event situation. Also, if you're working on getting yourself into shape for the upcoming spring and summer months, Andy Dumas will be joining us with another edition of Andy's Abs. Also, if you want to get into the kitchen with the kids but don't really want to get into the stovetop thing and heating things up too much, well, we've got some great ideas from the milk calendar coming up on the show. But first, let's talk about what's happening out here on this beautiful spring day with Todd from Sunlight. Hello. Great to have you on Real Life. Thank you very much. Now, Sunlight has really made an effort to, uh, well, I, I know I have two kids at home. It's all about being green, and you've really taken the bull by the horns in this green movement with the kids. Yeah, it's the Sunlight Eco Action Kids Award. It's a national program that's designed to recognize Canadian kids for their environmental initiatives across the country. Wow, mm -hmm. and you really got a great response when you put it out there. Yeah, we had almost 300 entries coast to coast. Uh, and then we picked 18 regionalists through our environmental partners. And then uh, the Canadian public, public voted down to three uh, finalists, which we announced here today. That's fantastic. And we have to mention that these are not um, college, university, when we talk kids. We're talking kids. And this is really the, the future. Absolutely. The age category was 6 to 12. Mm -hmm. um, and it's unbelievable the initiatives that they're already doing at that age to make a difference. And more importantly, how important the environment is to them. So by showcasing their stories through these Sunlight Eco Action Kids Awards, mm -hmm. we hope to empower the next generation to really take action. And Sunlight has gone a step further. I have to compliment you on the website that goes with this. Thank event. you. Thank you very much. Now, this is a, a website that I guess was partly to promote the event, but it's an ongoing effort. Absolutely. So it will continue to live after we announce the winners here today. Mm -hmm. um, you can join the Eco Action Kids Club, uh, which we provide monthly downloadable activities uh, that are all around environmental education. Uh, you can join the Eco Action um, Forest and actually build an eco forest by tracking your initiatives at home mm -hmm. and plant the eco trees uh, and track how many trees you plant online. But that was the feature I really liked because mm -hmm. this is where it kind of invited it to go from beyond just the kids and invite the parents. I guess that that's the big effort is because we were all raised with use what you want and don't worry about it and it's hard to retrain an adult. Absolutely. So hopefully through the kids and the initiatives they take in their stories we can empower all of us to really understand the small differences we make have a mighty impact long term. And uh, Sunlight um, as a product has really done a part too to help uh, do the environmental changeover. Yeah we launched uh, Sunlight three times concentrated small and mighty back in August 2006 and since then it's dramatically reduced uh, the amount of water we use, the amount of plastic we use, the amount of trucks we use from a transportation cost standpoint, and the amount of corrugate that we use to ship. So it's uh, we significantly reduced our impact, uh, imp footprint on the environment. That's fantastic. And I'll tell you what, there's going to be a lot of sunlight used after what I'm seeing going on Absolutely. with the kids over there. They're going to be needing it. Now, if we have families that would like to participate, maybe check out the website if they haven't already, where should we send them? Send them to www.sunlightecoactionkids.ca, all one word. That sounds good, yeah. and uh, we have lots of great stuff to show you going on here, including playing in the mud. Excellent. That's coming up. Thanks for joining us today. Thank now, you. spring and summer is right upon our doorstep. We want to be getting into better and better shape, and I know usually it's right around here. We look to Andy Dumas now for some help in that department with another edition of Andy's Apps. Andy Dumas here. I'll answer them. Promise. <laughs> Still to come on Real Life, more from the Eco Action Kids Awards and how young Canadians are taking the initiative to improve our world. Welcome back. Well, we're here with two of our three finalists from the Eco Action Kids Awards. Congratulations, guys. Catherine, this is really a spectacular awards program. Tell me about the selection process of how you arrived from 300 entries and got it down to three. Well, actually, it was a pretty big process. We had uh, a lot of uh, good uh, people working with us. We had several judges from uh, Pembina, uh, Zero Footprint, and so forth. And they came down with 18 finalists. And from these 18 finalists, basically all around Canada, we were called to vote for our favorite kid online. So basically, uh, we happened to have three winners out of the votes. Uh, 9,000 votes were cast. 
and uh, our winner from Quebec is uh, from the age category from six to seven, Manuel. And then uh, we have uh, Montana here from uh, age nine, who's from uh, BC, who won, and uh, Anna, unfortunately, who couldn't make it here. Uh, she's 10 and she's from Alberta. Terrific. I wanted to ask Manuel, uh, first of all, congratulations. And uh, could you tell us a little bit about what you did to win this contest? Elle aimerait savoir ce que tu as fait pour gagner ce concours. Mm. Ceci, ce que tu as fait. Euh, Regarde la caméra. Euh, quand j'ai fini de jouer à l'ordinateur, euh, je le fais. Hein. Euh, J'essaye de mettre le plus possible de choses en bas. Euh, à la maison, on récupère les sacs de plastique pour les amener chez les gérants pour qu'ils en fassent d'autres. Euh, quand je sors d'une pièce, j'étais en lumière. Hmm. Quand euh, je gaspille pas l'eau pour rien. Puis, euh, quand je peux le réutiliser un mouchoir, euh, je le mets à quelque part. Euh, C'est tout. So basically what he said is um, when he uses a computer and he's done with it, he closes it. When he leaves a room, he closes the light. Uh, when he uses a, a Kleenex or a handkerchief, he uses <laughs> more than once. Uh, he recycles as much as he can. And um, he also made eco-friendly bags that his mom uh, uses to shop. And it's really, it's really the little things that make a big impact, things that we can be doing every day. And we can't help but forget about Montana who, first of all, how did you get covered in dirt, young man? Well, um, we were launching these little um, seed pockets of um, native plants to this area and um, somebody uh, wasn't a very good aim and they uh, <laughs> hit me in the back, so yeah. But you've got some good detergent at home to get this cleaned yeah. up, right? Yeah. Good I stuff. Um, I want to talk to you, Montana. What did you do to win this award? Well, um, at my school, I run a composting program um, with my green team and um, I, after school every day I go around and collect each classroom's compost and um, also our green team has a soft plastic recycling depot and they even got our entire school, school district to go green. It's very important. I, you're no, I mean to have an idle free zone, sorry. To have, this is very important. Well, I want to congratulate both of you guys. Thank you so much for joining us. It's been a pleasure to meet you and uh, certainly a good sign of our Canadian future. Thank you so much. Look forward to seeing more of our uh, bright and talented youth in the future for the Sunlight Eco Action Kids Awards. And where can people go to get more uh, information about this entire awards program? Well, they can go on the site. So it's uh, www.sunlight.ca and uh, you'll see you'll have more information on the winners as well as more information on the product and the campaign. Great. Thanks, guys. More Real Life coming up. Coming up on Real Life, no-bake treats that take minutes to make. Simple recipes for chocolate haystacks and no-fuss smoothies when we return.